fix broken speakers. If you have broken speakers like me, I'll take you on a step-by-step -step guide to fix them. Let's get into it right away. The first step to fixing your speakers is to take your speakers out from your computer or wherever you have them. Do this very, very carefully though. Alright, now that you've done step one, we are going to move on to step two. Make sure you're, you are in a uh, outside environment or somewhere where you can work, like sparks fly and everything. Alright, so I'm in a garage, and this is a great area to start working on your uh, speaker that I got here. Uh, so yeah, the second step is to actually open up your speaker. And all you'll need for this is a hammer. This process is so simple that you don't even need to find a screw. So make sure you have a hammer and your speaker. Now, just to open it up, just follow what I do. I'm going to find about the middle of the speaker and do a couple good hard hits to open it up. Alright, ready? Set. Alright, as you can see, the speaker is now opened. That was extremely simple and easy. So, if you want, you can even take it out a little bit more and open it a little bit. Here. And as you can see, that falls out. Keep going. Yeah, so we opened it up. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, yeah, you can't even see that. So, now that we've opened it, uh, on to step three. Okay, so step three is cleaning the speaker. Because inside of the speaker, I cracked it a little bit, uh, but inside the speaker, once we really get in there, the parts are probably all dusty, and that may be one of the reasons that they're not working. So I have the perfect concoction, concoction to make sure that we can clean the speaker really well. So the first ingredient is some milk. So let me just open this up. Whoopsies. Got some milk. Second ingredient is some Coca Cola. That really eats away some of the dirt. And some eggnog, of course. Wonderful. And then some Hershey's syrup for our last ingredient. It may smell absolutely horrible, but that's what we need to clean the speaker. All right? So, whoa, okay. So, let's get cleaning. Okay, before we start cleaning, we actually just going to have to crack this open just a few more times to really make sure that this stuff goes in. So, I'll just crack it. Whoa. <laughs> this speaker is actually really durable. There we go. So now, just take this thing off like that. So, we're just going to pour it onto that circuit. Right in there, circuits. There we go. Uh, yeah. So now, to really get it clean, I shake it up a little bit. And yeah. So, 
On to step four. Part four is actually fixing the speaker. You're one step away from being able to finally hear your speaker in action again. So open it up. And, you know, duct tape fixes everything, right? Well, it's got to duct tape this in, you know? Fixes everything. Duct taping this up. There we go. Get nice and good in there. Yeah. Okay, so now pretty much the parts are all fixed. And the last step is putting it all back together. So, see you for step... Okay, for step five, you'll need a hammer and a welder. Ha! Okay, so for the hammer, all we gotta do is put these two parts back on top of each other and then hammer them together. Oh, I missed. Try again. Ready? Second time. And pretty soon, the more you hit them, the more they'll go back together. Hammer this circuit. Okay, and for the welder, we'll just weld the two together. Okay guys, the welder is ready. I'll start using it in three, two, one. Oh, 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 oh. <coughs> That's how you... properly now. Anyway, if this video helped you at all, please make sure to leave a like. Maybe it fixed your speaker. And until next time, <coughs> bye from the Corncrafter. Bounce.